Yeah. It's now time for weather every few minutes. Kirsten. Good morning, guys. Well, we're looking at uh, for a day very similar to what we saw yesterday. Uh, we're going to be seeing a little less humidity than last week. Those temperatures uh, back in the low 90s and uh, lots of sunshine. So right now as we're starting off at 71 degrees and you have light winds. They're in from the northwest at three miles per hour. Dew points are very much like yesterday too, coming in in the 60s and we'll continue to look for those mid 60s for dew points throughout the day. Uh, so temperatures up towards the northeast are in the upper 60s. So mid to upper 60s depending on where you're waking up. Bartlesville is one of the cooler spots at 65. 71 here in Tulsa. Same with Muskogee. Mid 70s down in McAllister. Much like yesterday, you do have that ridge of high pressure just off towards the uh, towards the west. And so what we're going to be looking for again today are the hottest temperatures still to the west of us. We're still getting a little bit of a break with some of these northerly winds that will continue through the day today, uh, providing again lower humidity and temps back down in the low 90s pretty much all across the area. May even see some 80s out there as well. On your future track, it is quiet. We are going to be seeing a few passing clouds. Otherwise, that north wind and uh, those highs and getting on up to about 93 here in Tulsa, some low 90s up towards the northeast. So we hit 94 yesterday. We'll be very close to where we were on Monday. 93 is also expected in Muskogee, Stigler, and McAllister. Low 90s also in Pryor and Bartlesville this afternoon. So then going into the overnight hours, it stays quiet with a few clouds and light winds as we head into the start of our Wednesday morning. We're going to see temps in the mid to upper 60s. We'll start the day off around 69 in Tulsa, 65 in Pryor, about 64 in Grove and Coffeeville. So for today, those temperatures will be warming up to the mid 70s by 9 and then the mid to upper 80s by your lunch hour. We're starting to warm up already there by that lunch hour heading into the afternoon, then topping off at 93. You'll see a few of those passing clouds. Again, lower humidity and north wind, about 5 to 10, sometimes 15 miles per hour. But dry conditions are expected today, and we'll continue to see dry conditions for the next couple of days uh, ahead. Today, tomorrow, really for most of the day on Thursday. Thursday night, you may see a few showers, and then our chance for rain will increase as we head towards the weekend. Right now, it looks like our best chance for rain is actually going to be on Sunday, and that's as a front moves through the area. That will provide, though, uh, cooler conditions for next week. So you see Monday we will start the week off with those temps in the mid 80s and mostly sunny skies as well as those uh, showers move on out of here by the end of the weekend. Scott Lisa.